Hey guys, Ruby here and if you are new to my channel, please subscribe for more videos. I do videos every Monday. So today I'm gonna be showing you guys what's in my vanity or a vanity tour. I actually don't have a real vanity. I just have a writing desk that I got from Walmart for 40 bucks and I used to have that desk right there. That's the one behind me. That's the one that I used to have but then I've had that for like five years so I decided to get a new one and I actually needed uh, just a plain desk that I could move around my arms a lot when I'm doing makeup. And also I don't have a lot of makeup compared to other YouTubers but compared to an ordinary girl out there probably I have a ton but yeah um, I've collected this makeup for I think five years now and this video is by the way requested by I'm pretty KZ01. I hope I said her username correctly but yeah she requested for me to do this video so that's why I'm doing this and if you guys have any video requests please comment down below and let me know and I'll do it for you guys so yeah thank you so much for watching and let's go and tour my vanity I guess so this is my vanity and it's just a writing desk that I got from Walmart and the folding chair was from Target and it's not really that nice <laughs> yeah, and all the makeups that I have that I've been using quite a lot are the ones on top of my vanity and yeah, I have that towel right there because I use it whenever I am putting my makeup on, I put it on my lap or I put it on top of the table or the desk. And then I have this drawer organizer that I got from Walmart I think before and it's not really that pretty either but I... <laughs> put all my makeups and nail polishes in there and yeah let's get closer to the table so I have two acrylic organizers on top of the table and those were from uh, Ross I think or uh, Marshalls I can't remember now but this one uh, the drawer organizer carries all my lipsticks and then this vanity organizer carries all my Makeup palettes, brushes, uh, everyday makeups that I use when I'm getting ready for work and all that. And I'm going to bring you guys closer so you can see what every uh, organizer has. So those are all the lipsticks that I have. And also I, I think I still have some more lipsticks on one of my purses. I don't know because I always put lipsticks on my purse and I forget to take them out. And if you guys are interested for a lipstick collection video, thumbs up this video. <laughs> and if I get maybe 10 likes then I'll do uh, makeup uh, what is it a lipstick collection video so that's it a lipstick in this one and also more lipstick on the second drawer <laughs> and more lipsticks on the third drawer I know that's a lot of lipstick okay moving on to this organizer right here so I have all the palettes, um, the high-end palettes that I own, I have them all right here. I have a Too Faced uh, Chocolate, Semi-Sweet Chocolate Bar Palette. I have uh, Urban Decay Naked 2 Palette. I have the Naked 3 as well. I don't have the Naked 1. I might probably get that one, but I don't know. I'm not sure yet. And then I have a Vice Palette, which... Most of these palettes were from my husband. He bought them for me for special occasions. And then I also have, this is the newest palette that I have in my collection. This is the Vice 4 palette. And I also have the Urban Decay. I forgot what this is called. I think the Edge palette, if I can remember it right. Um, yeah. Beauty with an Edge, I don't know. I don't know what palette this is then. But it's also from Urban Decay. And also I have the Urban Decay Naked Flush palette right there. And then another Urban Decay, which is the Basics palette. And then I have all the blushes that I'm using currently right here. And also the uh, powders. Right here I have NARS. I think this is the NARS Orgasm palette. I have MAC uh, Blush. I think this is the Floor power full power blah, blush I can't remember but this is the only MAC blush that I own right now but I'm planning on getting more and then I have a Milani brush this uh, brush is a brush blush this is a very amour 
And then my favorite blush of all time is the Raketeur by Benefit, which is this one. And I have bronzer by NYC, and then CoverGirl uh, powder, Milani powder right here, and then Revlon Photo Ready Prime and Anti Shine. And then on this side right here, I have Benefit Pore Professional Agent Zero powder. I have Benefit Roller Lash Mascara. Benefit H Rewind Concealer right here for my dark circles or under eye. I have NYX um, Concealer. And then I have my Too Faced Prime and Poreless Powder, Loose Powder right here. Some more concealers and um, what they call primers. And then all my brushes are right here. Oh, actually no, these are not all the brushes that I have. I have more brushes that I'm not using on one of those drawers that I have. And then this is the setting spray that I'm currently using. This one was from Icing and only $5.50. <laughs> And it's a big bottle, so yay. Good price. And then I have Makeup Forever Full Coverage Concealer, which I rarely use because it's too thick. And then I have a dual sided mirror. This is just a regular high. <laughs> regular, and then it has the, what do you call it now? Magnified side also, right here. I forgot where I got this from. Probably Target or Ross. And then behind it, I have another acrylic organizer which I got from the dollar section at Target I think and I don't know it's supposed to be for um, like an office supply whatever but it carries all my foundations so in here in the front I just have two um, sponges um, what do I call them now? beauty blenders <laughs> and they're dirty because I just used them and then I have a primer uh, from Smashbox and it's just uh, the travel size. I like that size and then I have a BB cream or no This is a foundation from CoverGirl the ready set gorgeous foundation. Oops My favorite foundation of all time because it's very lightweight and also um, It covers really good. Um, this is the Urban Decay Naked Skin foundation and I have a foundation from Makeup Forever and this one I only use for like special occasions because it is very thick. And then I have another foundation here from CoverGirl. And this is the Stay Fabulous Outlast foundation which I use rarely. And then I also have planner on top of my desk or vanity. And then moving on to the left side I have all my lip balm and lip treatment and lip butters and all of that if you want a collection I mean a video of my collection of lip balms then thumbs up this video as well then I'll do lipstick and lip balm collection video moving on to the drawer um, this drawer is really <laughs> not that deep it's very shallow so I can only put a little bit of stuff in there and let's see what I have in here I think I mainly have like lip balm uh, brow powder right there mascaras and eyebrow uh, gel and then uh, what is this now eyelash curler and all of that I just put them in here those small things that can get lost easily and I have um, eyeshadow primer or yeah eye primer and then most of my primers are here I have one from Sonia Kashuk I have one from uh, what is this now Etude House and I have one from Maybelline I actually have two from Maybelline the instant H rewind and the baby skin uh, primer and I have a brush cleaner uh, from e.l.f. and then uh, I think I have this one is eyelash glue and then I have some eyelashes on the back false eyelashes right there and then I also have a hand cream and then I have two palettes that I use uh, most of the time whenever I don't want to use my expensive palettes you know I use this one from Maybelline I have the nude and also the blush nudes so yeah those are that those are what's inside my drawer and also I have all toys there you go and moving on to this drawer right here top of the drawer I just have this frame that I got from Ross and I printed out this uh, saying keep calm and carry on and yeah I just put it inside and I have an Audrey Hepburn book and my vlogging camera it's right there and the first drawer, let's see what I have in here. I have blush from Milani. 
NYC, whatever, color wheel, bronzer. I have NYX blush. What shade is this? Terracotta. I have Wet n Wild blushes, Cover Girl, right here. And this is Wet n Wild in Pearlescent Pink. What else? What shade is this one? Heather Silk. I love Wet n Wild blushes. They are very, very pigmented. And then I have one from... Oh, it's, this is also <laughs> Wet n Wild. This is a Mellow Wine shade. And then I have a NARS Trio, the Narcissist. Uh, I think this one has a highlighter, bronzer, and also a blush. And more blushes back. And I have this one. It's really cute. I've got this from the Philippines. This is the House um, blush in the shade Sur 3. <laughs> but this is a more like coral tone blush. And I have a bunch of this Maybelline Color Tattoo um, eyeshadows. I have a bunch of those right here and I have this Urban Decay eyeshadow in the shade Space Cowboy. And then some other stuff right here too. I think mascara. Um, what else? Mostly like sample products. I just put them right here on the side. Second drawer. Mm, more eyeshadow palettes. Wet n Wild ones. And... This ones were from Japan, I think. My friend brought this and yeah, she gave this to me as a uh, gift from Japan when she went to Japan. I don't know if they're really from Japan, but I just really love the packaging and all of that. So cute. And then I have some mascaras right here. Travel sizes, I have a lot, so I just kept them right here so I could use them also. And then I have eyeliners right here this ones are from urban decay my husband got this for me for christmas and then i have a niche dough um, bronzer this one i got from the philippines so i've had this for like five years <laughs> and then i have um bh cosmetic palette the 120 color right there in the back of my drawer and then this one i think is like a concealer palette so i have like a bunch of concealers right there and that's that for the second drawer third drawer Third drawer, I have no polishes, and that's it. In the last drawer, I have my extra brushes in here, and also travel sizes, makeup um, bags, and that's that. That's it for my vanity tour, guys, and I hope you like it, and thumbs up if you did. It gets a little shaky, but yeah, that's it. That's where I usually do my makeup, in front of a... Uh, Bintana windows <laughs> and yeah oh actually guys that chair I got from Ross and I don't use it because it's too high and I'm too short so I use this foldable chair from Target instead but yeah thank you guys thumbs up and subscribe bye